Welcome. Today we'll be looking at Spider Oak, a cloud backup and storage solution that offers products for home use, businesses, and enterprise. We'll be looking at the business version. This review is brought to you by Technology Advice and the Smart Advisor tool, which lets you compare 50 cloud backup and storage companies in two minutes. Spider Oak puts a premium on security and encryption. They describe themselves as a zero-knowledge provider, meaning that all files are encrypted through their desktop client on your computer before upload to SpiderOak servers. That way, SpiderOak doesn't know the contents or even names of your files and can't decrypt them even if they were ordered to, say by a large government organization. Now, SpiderOak has both a web interface and a desktop client. You can see the web interface right here in the browser. Um, and that's really just a storage locker that you'll use for downloading files. So you'll interact with the program primarily through the desktop client, which you can see right here. Now, the status tab, which is where when you open it up, you'll go to, gives you an overview of any backups that you have going on right now. Uh, shows you the computer you're on, the network health, uh, any sync operations and uh, any files that are being shared. And then at the bottom here is a storage bar showing your total amount of storage and the amount you're using. There's also a backup and sync queue right here and an actions and log panel that are just going to show you all the different things you've done in the program and some stats once you get a few files in there. You can go to the Backup tab, and this right here is the basic view, and it just gives you the general categories on a computer, desktop, documents, movies, music, and you can check to back up the entire thing. Or you can switch to the Advanced view right here, and that's going to give you a breakdown of all the different subfolders and uh, files inside of them if you want to really fine-tune what you're backing up. Also, once you choose what to back up, It'll do it automatically from then on. So any changes you make to the files will automatically be synced to SpiderOak servers. The View tab is just a basic file browser. And you can see what you've already backed up to SpiderOak. The Sync tab, meanwhile, is where you'll control SpiderOak Hive and see what's happening there. SpiderOak Hive, as you can see, is this little folder that's going to be installed on your desktop and it works sort of just like a Dropbox add-on. Um, it's their feature that is just a folder that if you drag anything into it, it'll sync with their online platform and you can access that through your phone. So that's just an easy way if you need to share a file for later in the day or on the go. But it's uh, more of an add-on to the full Spider Oak program. Then the, if you click the Share tab, it'll ask you to sh set up a Share ID and a share ID is just a public username, pretty much. And you can give it out, um, and it'll be used to identify you when you share photos or movies with people that you know. Um, they recommend that you use a different name than your username, just so that people don't know your actual username. Uh, again, they place a premium on security. And so that's the two interfaces of Spider Oak, an overview of their features. For pros, it is a zero-knowledge storage service, as we mentioned before, so your files are pretty much as safe as they can be. Um, it also offers automatic backup, which is convenient for businesses or forgetful home users. And it includes Spider Oak Hive, which is a nice shared folder if you just need things on the go. The drawbacks to Spider Oak, um, as you can see, the desktop interface is a little dated could definitely use a refresh. It's still usable, just not pretty. Um, and the initial setup can be confusing. You can't log on to their web interface until you set up the desktop client, mostly because it's just a file locker again. Um, but that's not readily apparent when you first sign up for an account. Before you make any decisions on cloud storage, however, I recommend you go to technologyadvice.com and check out their smart advisor tool. That's going to allow you to compare Spider Oak to over 50 different cloud backup and storage companies in under two minutes and give you customized recommendations based on all your needs. Thanks for watching.